Now, I'm going to read this way from the back of my deck today. We're looking at this one. This is the 17th Kingdom Avant Guard deck. One of the more interesting or unusual decks I've gotten. And we'll be looking at it on my channel. It's by Stockholm 17 and Lorenzo Giagatti. And special shout out to him for sending me another one after the original one that I ordered. Apparently got lost somewhere. I don't know what happened to it. <laughs> Never shipped out for some reason. Anyways, this is basically a uh, one of a kind glass hour, or is that hourglass shape? I guess it is. Really cool. It was originally a Patreon exclusive deck. It was an experimental thing they did in 2022, and he offered it up as rewards. But that one is a bit different, uh, at least in the color, the box, and everything. Yeah, it says this is a box. It is a first of its kind that I know of. Uh, fold box that has zero glue in the construction of it. And it has two foils and embossing. It says the 17th Kingdom of Guard on the front. And S17. And it says here Marta Liderna, something. Marta Liderna? I don't know, something in Latin, obviously. <laughs> and you see. One of the cards on the inside. And the side, you see the edges of the card. It's this uh, matte red color. Matte red edge printing is what it is. Not really a gilding, but similar. And it says copper DM on the one side with the hourglass. And the other side, the same thing. Though it has uh, something. Tepus Fugit. Time Forget or something like that. Avant guard on top, on the bottom the ad copy. It's made uh, in Italy at the China. Very cool. And I'll show you the box how it works. It pulls out like this and flips open. And the inside, there we go. It's a nice red color, kind of a matte finish almost. And here's the cards. Very interesting, very unusual. The back design has a bunch of snakes on it, a couple of snakes wrapped around and some crowns, 17 on them. Very cool shape. The Jokers, there's three of them. There's that one. There's that one. And there's that one. Very interesting. And there's also a Gath 17 of Diamonds card. Lots of detail in the background. The same snakes that you see on the, the backs or in the background. Very cool. Here's the Ace of Spades. It says the 17th Kingdom. I'm not a big fan of this font that they used. Uh, it's uh, a little hard to read. But here's the number cards. Completely custom. And the court cards. This one's Hiding, hiding his face at least. <laughs> Very interesting. Again, it says something in Latin on the Ace of Hearts. And yeah, not bad. Do they shuffle? Do they ruffle shuffle, you might be asking? And the quality, by the way, I believe these are printed by WJPC. The quality is just a fairly standard playing card stock. I do know that they fan. <laughs> I'd like to see a card, decent card to with these. And um, they ruffle shuffle. Very nice. Overall, really interesting deck, really unique. I'm going to give it a solid A+++++. Plus, 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 plus. Very interesting, very unique, beautiful artwork. I like it. Comment, like, subscribe, and what you think. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.